I think people tend to think of eggs almost exclusively for breakfast, but I think they're perfect for lunch, especially when cooking a dish like this, which is a frittata, which I'm going to flavour with some wonderful green basil pesto and some sun-dried tomatoes. So to start off with, I've got six eggs in a bowl, to which I'm going to add some pesto, about a teaspoon and a half, and into that my sun-dried tomatoes. Mix those really well with a fork. And in this bowl, I've got some potatoes, which I've sliced very thinly and then cooked in olive oil, but on a really low heat, so it's cooked them through without colouring them. Now to that, I'm going to add the egg mix. Touch of seasoning. Now very carefully stir that through. Be quite gentle because the potatoes are very soft and you don't want to break them up too much. Okay. Into my frying pan, glug of olive oil, and straight in with the frittata mix. Now we're cooking this very gently because what we don't want to happen is to burn the bottom of that and then you get that acrid bitter taste. So cook it very, very gently. So we're gonna put the lid on and that's going to cook for about 15 minutes until that frittata starts to set. Now there's still just a little amount of wobble still in that, which means it hasn't cooked on the top. So what I'm going to do is take that off the heat, and now just to cook the top of that frittata, I don't want the bottom to burn, I'm going to pop that under the grill. Now that frittata's cooked all the way through, but because the pan is still screaming hot because it's just come out from under the grill, I'm going to leave that there for about five minutes before turning that onto a plate. So now the moment of truth. This bit's always a worry. But thankfully not this time. My pesto and sun-dried tomato frittata, perfect for lunch, hot or cold.